Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the MCQ related with Harbor Engineering in the topic of Harbor Maintenance. So the first question, excavation of bed below the water is called option A, dredging, option B, silting, option C, erosion, option D, none of the above. The correct answer is option A, dredging. Next question, maintenance dredging is common for option A, river harbor, option B, harbors having tidal basins, option C, both A and B, option D, dry docks. The correct answer is option C, both A and B. Next question, the type of material excavated during maintenance dredging will be option A, rocky, option B, sandy, option C, silty, option D, both B and C. The correct answer is option D, both B and C. Next question, the dash dredging system is satisfactory in the case of dash dredging work while dash dredging system is satisfactory for dash dredging work. Option A, direct labor, capital, contract, maintenance. Option B, contract, capital, direct labor, maintenance. Option C, capital, direct labor, maintenance, contract. Option D, none of the above. So the correct answer is option B, the contract dredging system is satisfactory in the case of capital dredging work while direct labor dredging system is satisfactory for maintenance dredging work. Next question, which of the following structure is the heaviest? Option A, sea wall. Option B, bulk head. Option C, revetment. Option D, groinus. The correct answer is C wall. Next question, which of the following sea wall receives latest wave thrust? Option A, sloping. Option B, vertical. Option C, stepped. Option D, both B and C. The correct answer is option A, sloping. Next question, which sea wall absorb the greatest wave thrust? Option A, sloping sea wall. Option B, vertical sea wall. Option C, concave faced sea wall. Option D, none of the above. The correct answer is option C, concave faced sea wall. Next question, the stability of revetment is governed by option A, size of stone, option B, slope at which stone are laid, option C, both A and B, option D, none of the above. The correct answer is option C, both A and B. Next question, a low wall or sturdy barrier built out into the sea from the beach to check erosion and drifting is called option A sea wall, option B breakwater, option C groining, option D none of the above. So the correct answer is option C groining. Next question, which of the following bulkhead anchorage is suitable where the existing ground level is at or above the bottom of the anchor? Option A seat pile dead man anchorage, option B simple dead man anchorage, option C battered pile anchorage, option D frame pile anchorage. So the correct answer is option B, simple dead man anchorage. Next question, which type of anchorage is adopted where the hydraulic placing of the fill is carried out? Option A, sheet pile dead man anchorage. Option B, battered pile anchorage. Option C, frame pile anchorage. Option D, both B and C. The correct answer is option D, both B and C. Again we will see next video. Thank you.